chocolate drizzle on it? Chocolate? Yeah. Uh, can I do both? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a coffee shop in the menu. Also asked them to put um, coffee in it, but I didn't get coffee because I wanted to have the kids try it. So that one was a 16 ounce, and I think the protein shake is five dollars. Um, it's pretty good. It's a uh, chocolate. They give you the option of doing chocolate or vanilla. So I asked for a chocolate protein. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. And then I got the. I couldn't find the one that I saw at. Um, I like that. on their Instagram so I just got two iced caramel macchiatos with chocolate drizzle and this is it right here I need to shake it up but that place is pretty good their prices are decent everything's like 5 and under and they have um, also Red Bull smoothies so they make uh smoothies with Red Bull and they're pretty cool. I'll put some pictures of their uh, Red Bull smoothies. Uh, maybe in the summer I can head out and show you guys and order some. But I'm on my way home and then when I get home I'll show you guys a closer look of what they look like. and then we can 
can get some of those smoothies. dropping off Sergio's coffee and um, the place is called Fresh Cup Espresso and uh, their uh, coffees are actually pretty good. I actually prefer them over Starbucks just because the price is um, a little less and then they're actually uh, different like flavors that you can get and they also have like if you're doing like a health um, if you're doing like a healthy alternative then you could do like the protein shakes that they have and they also have protein bars i believe they also have like those red bull drinks that i was talking to you guys about uh so they have like i think one is like pomegranate with red bull and then there's the glitter ones that i had mentioned which i'll put a picture here for you guys uh but yeah their prices aren't as bad I like i think they start at like three and then 345 and then four or something like that. Um, I took a video of the menu, so if you want to, you can pause it there and check out the prices. Um, but yeah, there. If you're ever around the Muldoon area, uh, there's a little park there also in the summer that you could go to and then get coffee there, and um, just kind of enjoy the park area while you drink your coffee. And that park is pretty neat. They have like a roller slide, which is pretty fun. There's not that many around that I've seen, but I used to love going down those. Uh, there was this place called, uh, back when I was in San Diego, they had a place called uh, Discovery Zone that had those uh, roller slides. And I loved going down those um, roller slides. But yeah, guys, so that was pretty much it. Just wanted to show you this coffee shop and for you guys to check it out if you get a chance. It's pretty neat. There's a whole bunch of like little coffee shops around Anchorage, um, which I'm sure also have like coffees like these, which I wanna try and um, if I get to them, I'll do another video. But uh, that was the one that closer to base. So that's why I went to that one. Yeah, the roads weren't were pretty icy, so I didn't end up really right driving around. Um, so I just went to the one here closer to base. But uh, I don't know if you guys saw, as I was driving on my way to drop off the coffee to Sergio, there was an accident there and there was another, a few other ones in the morning. Um, someone had mentioned that a uh, bus had uh, flipped over on Grady. Uh, so yeah, it was pretty bad this morning. So I didn't want to be driving around town as much. Uh, thankfully it wasn't as bad going towards Muldoon, but I really think they should have considered today being a, a condition black, but they ended up having school, which I ended up keeping the kids home just because I didn't want to risk them going and then something happened with the bus. So yeah, let me know uh, if you end up going and what you order. So yeah, that was pretty much it guys. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.